Hello, hello everyone. So I got out for a walk with the dogs and I went to Family Dollar because I wanted a pink drink. So I got a little pink drink here. Um, I poured it in a cup with some ice because uh, I love Starbucks pink drinks. And then I uh, browsed the toy aisle like I usually do because sometimes they have some LOL dolls there that I like or budget dolls. They have some Monster High dolls that are articulated in like $18. Um, and they look nice, but they also have like MGA Miniverse, mini brands, like all kinds of different blind bag toys and some Squishmallows. And I picked up a couple Disney blind bag toys. So I picked up some Disney adorable um, Squishalots. Uh, and I picked up this Disney adorable movie moment set it's got two figures and one display set um this was ten dollars and the uh the squish blind bag was five and then of course we're gonna compare that to our dollar store disney princess Masham, which i think would be great for like an easter basket if you want a cheaper option any of these really would be cool for an a Disney themed Easter basket um, but I want to see how they compare to each other uh, just based off price and whatnot so I'm kind of excited so don't <coughs> don't mind my excitement um, I'm very excited so I'm not entirely sure which one I want to start with I think we'll go with the uh, Dollar Tree Disney Princess Masham and see which one we get. I think we only get one. It is series six. Um, so let's let's get this open. It's weird because like the the thing, um, like the the thing is really hard to these Dollar Tree blind bag toys. They're really hard to open. It's it's not just me, okay. It, they're they're just not the easiest if you don't have like long nails um but this one might come off a little easier yeah it's coming off um quite a bit so that should be good and we'll open it up which disney princess did we get um and i kind of want to see if this will be good size to put in like the dollhouse as a doll and it looks like we got, it's very sticky, her hair. It's like sticky and rubbery. It's red and sparkly. She has a pink dress with little hands um, and like big eyes. Uh, but I think she would make a great doll for the dollhouse. I could definitely picture like my dolls kind of holding her um, with some doll photography and whatnot. Like how cool would that look? if you were sitting near the beach or, or something. So I definitely think I can use this in the dollhouse. The underside though has like, is like hollow and I'm not sure I'm a fan of that. Her hair is so rubbery. It's, it's very different from a Disney Dorable, but I actually really like it. I would buy more of these. They'd be cool to sit on a shelf too if you, you like Disney collectibles and things like that. Uh, so next we have the, the Squishalots. Um, we have, uh, the code is 2823SK01 in case you're looking for that. Um, and this, the Squishalots I know are kind of rubbery too. Um, like, kind of like the, the Disney Masham I just opened, but like really teeny. Um, the Disney Adorable Squishalots. And it, for whatever reason, it's not... It's not opening, so we're just going to use some scissors because, like, I'm pulling at the... Oh, there it goes. Never mind, I don't got to use scissors. That was good luck. Okay, so it looks like we have a couple of these. We have uh, at least two. We, we definitely have two. Um, we have a Disney Dorable Squishalots uh, guide. There is 50 to collect. Um, so hopefully I get some new ones that I don't already have. Here is the collector uh, list. Um, and they're really small, so these are easy to collect without like taking up 
too much uh, space, and they're five dollars. So this was a dollar, and the the squish a lots are five dollars. Um, but you get two of them, or or three, uh, according to the bag. It's series one. Um, so let's, let's rip this right open. Who did we get? Oh my goodness! Okay, it, who is it? It's from The Lion King, and that makes me excited already. I think it's from The Lion King. Okay, I think it might be a common. It's Simba! Oh my goodness, I love Simba. And they also kind of have like a hollowed out spot. Um as well and they're very very rubbery they actually kind of feel like a similar texture to like the mash them so that's strange why they call them disney squish -a lots i honestly don't know because they they feel the same um i'm gonna open the second one this is disney day woo because easter came and went on its way and we got eeyore how cute he is. Eeyore is my favorite. He's my spirit animal. Eeyore is just, he is having a rough, rough time most days, but he has some good friends. Uh, Eeyore is an ultra rare, so I'm really glad I got Eeyore. Um, I love Winnie the Pooh. So we'll put him right there on the desk next to the others and next to my trash pile. I feel like there might be a way to like reuse these capsules if you're creative. I don't know how, um, but uh, for those of you that might want to do that, that is an option. So the last thing we're moving on to is the Disney Dorables movie moments. It's series one. Um, there are a bunch to collect. You can see on the back of the box. And the code is 2823SKD1. I don't know if that tells you uh, which one you're getting. Uh, for $10, it seems a little expensive. Uh, but it does have, like, the, the display case. So I guess that makes it worth it. Um, I'm not entirely sure why you would be paying $10. Uh, let's just be honest. It seems kind of expensive for what you're getting. Like, I could get a Barbie for, like, 10 bucks. For under 10 bucks, Like, a whole big doll um, instead of a little, little figure. But I do love the Disney Dorables. And so I'm not sad that I just spent money on this, okay? I'm, I'm actually very, very happy. Um, my pink thing was probably the least expensive thing that I bought at, like, Family Dollar. Not even gonna, not even gonna say otherwise. Okay, so it looks like we have some sort of card. And then this is all, let's get rid of my trash so I can, uh, so I can see this with a clear head. What did we get? I think we got Toy Story. So it says Toy Story Series 1 Disney Dorable film released 11-22-1995. Characters are Woody and Buzz. And then it just kind of shows uh, this on the back. I don't know if this is like supposed to be a trading card or does it like, is it part of the, the scene that we're about to set up? It must be part of the, the scene. I'm so terrified I'm going to end up breaking this. Um, it does... Oh, 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 oh. It's got, like, little furniture pieces. Man, this is some fancy Disney adorable. Uh, so this is Series 1. They have Toy Story, Cinderella. There are Roost Cats, The Little Mermaid, Lilo and Stitch, Peter Pan, Winnie the Pooh, Steamboat Willie, Frozen, Aladdin, uh, and whatnot. And it does look like... Uh, this is gonna be your your background um, from the from the picture. So we're gonna we're gonna scoot our little background in like that. And then do I just like open the the furniture and put that in next? What are we what are we doing here? Okay, it looks like the bed. It looks like the bed goes in here. It it, it probably uh, I, I feel like the bed should like align with these like holes. I, 
I don't know why I feel that either. I just feel like that would make sense. So then I got Woody and I got Buzz Lightyear, which, I mean, honestly, I'm down for that, you know? That, to me, is, is pretty cool. I like Woody. I like Toy Story. I like to, like, rescue thrift store toys. So, like, I feel a connection to Toy Story. I'm not really sure what, like, that connection is. They do have little holes, so you can place them on, like, the scene. And then I guess you can display these. So we get, we're getting Buzz out now. Buzz is looking real cute. We're going to put him in our scene and get him right in there. And then I think we put the, uh, the, the, the glass part back on top to like finish. And we must put the glass part back on top because that, that's, would make sense to me. You know, I feel like it's not fitting properly, though, because of, like, the card. So what am I doing wrong here? That's, that's the real question of the day. What am I doing wrong? Okay. Now it looks like I, I got it right. Okay, that looks weird, though. It looks like the card doesn't really fit that well, but I don't know. It's kind of cute. So you can see the uh, the scene. Um, very cute. I, I feel like for $10, this is a lot, but it's almost like its own little like playhouse. Like you could use this as a dollhouse in a, a dollhouse potentially um, if you're a doll collector. You could put it on a shelf. It's got cool display purposes. It looks nice. Um, I like that it came with a little bit of furniture. Uh, you could use it as a playset. I feel like you'd get a lot of use out of that. Um, I feel like I'll get use out of this too. This is just as cool to me. And for like a dollar, you could put that in an Easter basket. Like just think about that, y'all. Just think about the Easter basket fun you could have. Um, let me know which Disney blind bag toy was your favorite today. Um, and I'll see you all tomorrow. Don't forget to like, comment, like, and subscribe. And do all those fun YouTube things because it helps the channel. Um, I'm excited because we're starting to grow as a channel and like that's exciting that y'all are enjoying my shorts, you're enjoying my videos and uh, it makes me feel good so uh, definitely hit that like button. Bye everyone.